He's accusing the wild carjacking of an ice cream truck, and now police say he didn't act alone. In fact, a woman that they first thought was a victim just may have been his accomplice. Good evening. I'm Tony Lopez. I'm Adrienne Moore. CBS 13's Yasmin Hassan is live for us in Rancho Cordova tonight, breaking down this bizarre crime. Yasmin? I mean, bizarre just to say the least of it. This story has an ice cream truck, a carjacking, and a police chase, which ended right here. You can see the remnants of it. This fence destroyed. There's broken glass everywhere. And the major development tonight is police, or deputies rather, are trying to track down a woman who they were talking to just yesterday. Only on 13 last night, we showed you this video. You can see a man hopping into an ice cream truck through the passenger side window. But take note, in this new video obtained by CBS 13, someone can be seen driving a black BMW in the same area the ice cream truck is being stolen. The guy in the ice cream truck takes off, eventually crashing into a ditch. It was more cops than what I've ever seen in Rancho. Sheriff's deputies say after crashing the ice cream truck, the man carjacked a black BMW. The woman driving that car gets out and goes with the deputies while the guy takes off again. Now, originally, deputies thought that woman was a victim, but now they're saying that 31-year-old Christina Beduza may have been in on this the whole time. They are now calling her a person of interest, and they want to track her down. But the suspect in this was eventually caught after crashing the BMW and taking off. Witnesses described seeing him with a black handgun as he was running through the field. The SWAT team was called in, and they eventually caught up with him, arresting 32-year-old Larnell Flornoy. Again, deputies are trying to track down Christina Pedusa. They originally thought this woman was just in the wrong place at the wrong time, but again, now they think that she may have been involved and she may have been an accomplice in this. A complicated and a bit confusing of a crime, Yasmin. Thanks.